Earlier, I asked the president of Bayshore, um, so if he would be willing to disclose what Bayshore as a corporation pays out in administrative costs and salaries to executives in its organization, is that something you would support in this bill? Mandatory disclosure of full administrative costs and executive compensation. Well, I have read the Auditor General's report and it certainly speaks to uh, issues related to executive compensation and um, on page 22, it, it, it goes into that in fair uh, degree of depth. Um, so that's a that's. So is that a yes? Would you agree to that full financial disclosure? I think that gets into uh, a whole discussion. Two uh, minutes. Bifurcated answer. Sorry. Well, no, but I think the people of Ontario, after decades of moving in a certain direction of delivering this care, we we went through the managed competition model. Many for-profit organizations outbid public organizations competing on labor, competing basically on the most expensive part of the business, which is labor. So I think people in Ontario, certainly people with disabilities and seniors, they deserve to know how much an organization is spending on administration and executive compensation. Do you agree? I think that's something that um, I would have to respectfully say again, the Auditor General's report was not as black and white about that um, as you suggest. Uh, happy to talk more about it. Um, there's, it's not a direct. Um, um, One minute. I, I'm going to I'm going to take that as as a note.